neighbors up. Hey, wake the neighbors up. They're drinking black party. Wake the neighbors up. Hey, wake the neighbors up. Wake the neighbors up. Yo, what up? It's Vega. Y'all already know. I'm um, about to do a photo shoot right now. This is my first look. Y'all can follow me on Instagram, Miss La Vega, and on Twitter, on the on the Facebook, and yeah, check me on YouTube too. Well, here we have my sister Taina, my sister Penny, her best friend Catherine. They came Shout out to show my support. best friend Kayla, Justin, Ernest, Kamaya. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> we here. They here to show support and to see what it's like, you know. When La Vega does the photo shoot, so just do this. What's up, it's your boy Celebrity Photographer Felix the Town Jr. aka the Beast of the East. We're here today at the Art Factory. Um, here shooting La Vega for our new CD project. So make sure you follow our Instagram and Twitter. You can follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Felix Natal Jr. And see more of my work at www.felixnataljr.com. Peace. Wake the neighbors up, and wake the neighbors up, wake the neighbors up. Let you can black party, wake the neighbors up. Ooh. Get to wallet while it turn up. Ooh. That's the fire heat that burns up. Ooh. That's the wallet while it turn up. Ooh. That's the fire heat that burns up. Wallin' out and wasted, we wallin' on some rebel shit. Attitude is real, raw, real, well, I gon' settle shit. Feelin' hate the mellow. Ain't talking Carmelo. My life is such a drive. Go fast and hit the pedal. Well, so we just finished doing uh, the first shoot, the first outfit. So now we're doing the second outfit, second look. And this is what I'm wearing. My hair, my lips. Yeah. I'm about to get started, right, y'all? Yeah. Ready? Atmosphere's infested with that green, you know that loud, loud. We kicking bitches out if they smell like pack a loud, loud. Oh, um, I was ready before I, uh, I started with uh, MVP. Um, I can't really like pinpoint exactly the time, but it's, it's been a while before that, and I had stopped for a period of time, and then um, I started with MVP since 2013 last year in August. You got any future projects you're working on? Yes, I have a fifth mixtape coming out uh, soon, so everybody stay tuned in for that. What's the name? It's gonna be called Life Is Good. You said that's your first or your fifth? Fifth. Oh, okay. so it was my first IV behind. <laughs> what are people hear your music? They can hear it on SoundCloud, Miss La Vega, M I S S L A V E G A. Um, I have music on iTunes, you can search up La Vega, Amazon, um, Spotify. The music video? Yes. Where can they find them? On YouTube. You can search up Leaving Today, that's my first music video directed by Taya Simmons. You can find that. You click in it, um, go to Dawn Music, La Vega, and it comes right up. You can also search up uh, The Girl You Like, which is my most popular song. Um, you just search up The Girl You Like, La Vega, and it's there. Head up. You see the hand behind you a little bit more? Yeah. 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 I'd like one of the shots of the Um, the artist that I listen to is Nitty Scott MC. Shout out to her. I love her music. Um, Nicki Minaj. That's my that's my boo right there. Um, I listen to McMill. I listen to Rick Ross. I listen to J. Cole. Um, there's a lot of different artists I listen to. I listen to back in the day music. All types of music. What types of artists? Everyone's all the ones that are on the top right now, basically. Thriller, blow minds out existence, turning bitches bitter, collecting paper like mailbox, swiping like I'm a bad fox. We fuck with riches, we don't fuck with snitches, no seeing so in my sandbox. So annoyed with bitch niggas, straight ignored, no attention, in position like point guard, fired up, now that's contention, bring clarity to my moment, that clarity to my mind, that clarity.
clarity for my growing wind, that clarity for my shine. He love him a strong one, strong one, I'm on one. Recording this song one, La Vega, she born one. A good look, but I'm the wrong one. Thick fat ass with a thong on. See myself as either that or be an entrepreneur, being big, just running the fucking game. I see myself as one of the, I see myself in five years as one of the top artists, just like Nicki Minaj did her shit, just like that. Well, in my father's side of the family, our last name is Lavacat, but when they were back in the yard, it was La Vega. But I guess when they got here, I don't know what situation happened, that it became Lavagat. And when my grandfather first told me, you told me that um that the name was La Vega, I was like, I'm gonna roll with um, Lady La Vega. And then somebody told me, nah, you should just do La Vega. It sounds hot. And I was like, great. Yeah, right. And I just, I stuck with that ever since. Oh, interesting. La Vega is this other person, um, because me, you know, I was born as Stephanie, but I feel like La Vega and Stephanie as twins are two different people. There's, there's always another side to a person. You, sometimes you see a person and they're shy, and you don't know nothing about them. They could just be quiet as, as a mouse, and you don't know nothing about them, until you see that other side. Well, that's kind of like me. Like, I have this personality where um, Stephanie, she's shy, you know, sometimes she doesn't always speak out like she should. Um, she, she's very close up. But La Vega, she's wild. She likes to party. She likes to go off. She likes to go crazy. Dance. Go off. Curse people out. You know? She's wild. So, that's who La Vega is. When La Vega enters that booth, Stephanie's gone. It's La Vega. You can say I'm Dominican American. It has a little bit of Haitian in it. Um, my parents both are from DR. My um, my father's from the capital. My mother's from Cotuí. Um, and my father, his great grandmother, on his side, the Haitian runs in the blood a little. So I don't know if that counts, but yeah. <laughs> um, so yeah, Spanish. I was born in the Bronx, um, and growing up in the Bronx for me was like seen a lot of stuff, you know, um, struggled a lot with certain things. Um, you know, you, I was a, a quiet, shy girl who held in a lot who went through certain shit, who overcame certain circumstances, you know, knocked out her obstacles, grew into a different person, went through a lot of experiences, who made her who she is. A lot of experience that also changed her. I have a few of those haters or whatever, especially those undercover ones too. Um, but I'll, they don't phase me, you know. They always say, you know, watch your own plate. Because if you watch another plate, your shit's gonna get cold. So I just worry about me. They're not doing anything for me, so I'm, I'm gonna do me at the end of the day. And that's just what it is. If there was one female, matter of fact, if there was one artist you could, let's say, battle, who would you wanna battle? Battling is not really my thing. Okay. But, um. Or back and forth on diss tracks? I was like a challenge, because, you know, I feel like a challenge, you know, helps you, you know. How do I say it? When you challenge yourself, you get better. And, um. I feel like if I were to choose to be my artist to challenge myself with, I'd say probably Nitty Scott. And I, I love her, but you know, she would definitely be a good challenge for me. Let's get ton of business.
work each other off Like this is a fitness I ain't with the front and I need you to get this Don't be judging me, boy, I am a It's a wrap, make sure you check out Vega At www.felixthetaljunior.com It's a great photo shoot to you It's working with you So make sure you follow our Instagram and our Twitter at Miss La Vega M-I-S-S-L-A-V-E-G-A um, you can follow me on the on the gram, Facebook, and Twitter. Um, it was great working with you guys. We had a great team today. Shout out to um, my sisters who stood around to help me. Shout out to Chanel who did a great job with my hair, V with the outfits, the camera crew. You guys were terrific. Made me feel comfortable. So special thanks to Art Factory, Biggs, and Adiron for holding me down today. And make sure you check her out on feelingsintelligent.com.